With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Today our question is the distance between the points A cos alpha, A sin alpha and A cos beta, A sin beta will be where A is a positive integer. Right, so we know that the distance between two points x1, y1 and x2, y2 is root of x2 minus x1 whole square plus y2 minus y1 whole square. Right, we already have the points as A cos alpha and a sin alpha right and the second points are a cos beta and a sin beta right now we will put these points into the first equation and we will get the distance as y x2 minus x1 that is a cos beta minus a cos alpha whole square a cos beta minus a cos alpha whole square plus a sin beta minus a sin alpha whole square then opening the brackets a minus b square is a minus b whole square is a square plus b square minus 2ab so we will get a square cos square beta plus a square a square cos square alpha minus 2 times of a square cos alpha cos beta then the second term will give us a square sin square beta plus a square sin square alpha minus of 2 times of sin alpha and sin beta. And this is a whole under root. Right. After then we will get we know that a square cos square beta and uh, a square sin square beta taking a square common will give us cos square beta plus sin square beta right taking under root plus similarly for these two terms taking a square common cos square alpha plus sin square alpha right and then the other terms are minus 2 a square so minus 2 a square cos alpha cos beta plus sin alpha sin beta right and we know that cos square plus cos square x plus sin square x is 1 so this will give you a square plus a square it is 2 a square minus 2 a square cos alpha cos beta plus sin alpha sin beta whole under root right then taking 2 a square common will give us 1 minus cos cos a cos b plus sin a sin b is cos a cos b plus sin a sin b is cos of a minus b. So we can write here cos a cos b plus sin a sin b will give you cos a minus b that is cos of alpha minus beta. Right and we know that 1 minus 2 sin square theta is equals to cos 2 theta right and here we have cos theta that is uh, alpha minus beta that means our 2 theta is equals to alpha minus beta here so theta will become alpha minus beta by 2 so using this identity we will get cos 2 theta cos of alpha minus beta as 1 minus 2 sin square theta theta is your alpha minus beta by 2 2. So we will write it here. We will get 2a square 1 minus 1 1 minus 1 minus 2 square. So 1 minus 1 plus 2 taking minus uh, opening the bracket will give us minus 1 plus 2 sin square alpha minus beta by 2 right. This is your angle alpha minus beta by 2 and this will be cancelled out and we will get 2 times 2 so we can uh, make it as 2 outside the root and there are 2 a's also so we will have a outside the mod and there are 2 sin square so we will get only sin alpha minus beta by 2 and we know that a is greater than 0 right so we will put a mod here because after uh, root we will have a value of plus minus but we but but our a is greater than 0 
it cannot be negative so we will put a mod here and so the distance will be the final distance will be 2 times of a sin alpha minus beta by 2 under mod thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today